Hi, I'm Amanda Miller, one of the Red Cap Administrators here at University of Colorado Denver. Welcome to the University of Colorado Denver Data Entry in Basic Tasks Red Cap Tutorial. Red Cap is a data capture program put out by the University of Vanderbilt. It stands for Research Electronic Data Capture. There are two instances of Red Cap on campus. The first is the UCD Red Cap. This Red Cap is underwritten by CCTSI who provides it free of service for all IRB-reviewed research projects. Because of the support they give us, we ask that you support them by joining CCTSI. Membership is free. The UCD REDCAP is for IRB-reviewed data only. There is also a separate instance of REDCAP over at Children's. This is used internally there for non-research projects. If you are using the Children's REDCAP, your login will be linked to your Children's System account. However, if you're doing any kind of research project, you probably need the UCD REDCap. So how to use REDCap? The first thing you have to do is watch these REDCap tutorial videos and complete the quiz. After that, you'll receive instructions on how to set up your REDCap account. Once your account has been set up, send your username to the project manager so that they can add you to the appropriate project. Then you'll be ready to do data entry and work on managing study participants. Eventually, you'll be able to export your data for analysis. A REDCap project has four stages. The first is development. Development is when databases are created and edited. The second is production. Production is when all data collection should happen. Next, you have an active. When a project is made inactive, Data entry is temporarily halted. Finally, projects can be archived. This means that the project will be removed from your list of project databases, but REDCap administrators can always return it to production. The tutorial you are taking now will get you a data entry level account. This is the account that you need if you're going to be doing basic REDCap tasks, such as data entry, exporting data, and managing participants. If you're going to be doing more than that, you may need to get a full REDCap account. You need a full REDCap account if you're going to be doing project design, project management, or user management. If your full REDCap account is on the UCD system, you should use it for IRB-reviewed research projects. Students can also use REDCap for student projects under the supervision of an instructor. If your full account is on Children's, then you can use it for non-research projects within Children. If you are doing other research projects, you should use the UCD REDCap. To get a full REDCap account, you either need to complete the online tutorial for a full REDCap account or attend an in-person tutorial. Details on both methods can be found at redcapinfo.ucdenver.edu under How to Start. There are many helpful resources beyond this tutorial presentation. The first is at the redcapinfo.ucdenver.edu site where we have all our tutorial videos available for review. You can also look at the Help and FAQ or Training Resources pages at redcap.ucdenver.edu. These are resources put out by Vanderbilt itself or by the REDCap Consortium. They may not be as up-to-date as our tutorial videos, but may also go into more detail on some tasks. Your first human resource for help in a REDCap project should be your project manager. They can tell you how they want things done for their project. However, if you continue to have problems, you are always welcome to email us at redcap at ucdenver.edu. We should always get back to you within one business day. Now, let's look at how to do data entry in REDCap. 